morning hockey family, Etienne from Field Hockey Education. In today's coaching video, we'll be working on a nice shooting drill. With this shooting drill, you're going to take shots from your reverse stick shot, your tomahawk, and strong stick as well. And you're also going to be taking shots in the backspace. But in this video, I'll explain everything for you as a coach that you can use with your players. Thank you for watching this video. Enjoy it. And let's go. If you have not subscribed yet, please click that little icon in the bottom corner. Please like this video because it shows the support towards my channel. Thank you for all the support so far in this channel. I really do appreciate it. And enjoy the next video. So with this shooting drill, is you're going to pack cones out here for this player that's receiving on these cones to show them that they need to go against the grain. So this is going to be a defender maybe running from this side coming into the midfield and now we're just going to get the ball and we're going to dribble in the opposite direction against the grain. So how it will work is player one will pass the ball to player two. Player two will receive. And then start dribbling against the grain to get into space that one of their midfielders um, has probably made. So they got the ball and now they're just going to go back into the space that they've been created for. Then as soon as they get past these cones, they're going to go towards the circle and they're going to take a reverse stick shot. As soon as this reverse stick shot has been taken. Player one will take another ball and start dribbling towards this cone over here. Soon as player two took, took the shot, they're going to re-lead infield and then out to the top of the D. This ball is going to be played to them into the circle and then they're going to turn their body so that they can hit in the back space. So in this little space in the circle it's called the backspace. So they're going to try and get receive the ball, dribble towards this backspace, and then just take a shot towards the keeper. As soon as this is done, as soon as this shot has been taken backspace, player four will pass the ball to player three. They will receive, they will dribble against the grain into the space. They will get around the cones, go towards the circle, and then take a strong stick shot. As soon as this strong stick shot has taken, player four will take a ball and dribble towards this cone over here. Player three will then lead, after they took a shot, lead in towards the keeper and then out towards this backspace. Ball is going to be played to them. They're going to receive it, run a little bit more towards the backspace and then take a reverse stick shot. Or they can take a strong stick shot. Doesn't really matter what these guys are doing but we're teaching them now to use this backspace because these this space is normally a lot open in a game and nobody uses these this space so you're teaching your players to use this backspace to get space for themselves to actually get a shot away you as a coach can progress it you can maybe put some cones in there so they can do a uh, a 3D skills to get past a defender maybe or get, get past this defender's trailing stick. Who knows? You can upgrade it as you see fit. You can put more players in. Maybe use player two when they go against the grain. This player one can be an option going there. You as the coach can decide and you can upgrade it as you will. But this is a nice little shooting draw that you can teach your players that don't just go the normal way of... I'm leading towards this space. I'm going towards where the ball is. You need to teach them to go against the grain as well because they will find a lot more space if they start doing that as well.
So that was the nice shooting drill that you can use with your team. As you can see, there's a lot of against the grain running so that you can take shots um, from different types of spaces and then just knowing how to take shots from the back spots is really important in a game situation as well. Thank you for the support so far on this channel. Thank you for watching this video. See you next time. Bye-bye.